there have been a lot of questions about the difference between a fundamental or a derived unit and also what does SI mean and what are SI units. The difference between a fundamental unit and a derived unit is that fundamental units are units that are not made of anything else. There are only four fundamental units in the universe. One of them is mass, one of them is length, Another one is time, which is not on this list. And another one is charge, which is not on this list. So mass is fundamental and length is fundamental. The SI unit for mass is the kilogram. The base unit is still the gram, but uh, like in the metric system. And the SI unit is very much like the metric system. Uh, but it's more useful for science and in science we would use the gram but in the SI units we use the kilogram because it's going to be part of a lot of other derived units. SI really is French for international standard units. Uh, standards international or something like that, I don't know. But SI really is international standard units. So these others we've determined are all derived. Well area, what is area? What's well, a derived unit? And we get it by multiplying something like the length times a width, right? So the standard unit for length right here in SI is the meter. So what is a length times a width? If this is in meters and this is in meters, then the SI units are going to be meter squared or square meters. Volume is a derived unit too. And it's a length times a width times, well, a height. And in SI units, these lengths are a decimeter, one decimeter, and one decimeter. That's 10 centimeters or a tenth of a meter on each side. And that makes the liter, okay, which is one decimeter cubed or 1,000 milliliters okay so that would be 10 centimeters by 10 centimeters by 10 centimeters but the SI unit for volume is the liter for speed we determined it's a derived unit if we were in our car we would measure our speed in miles per hour but since we're using the SI unit um, it's going to be meters per second okay so meters per second will be for speed. Uh, density, which is often the uppercase P uh, rather than D, um, but uh, density is going to be mass divided by volume. Now remember volume itself is a derived uh, unit um, and so we use liters. Mass is fundamental kilograms so density will be kilograms per liter and we often also see grams per milliliter, but this is the appropriate SI unit. We often use this unit for density when we're comparing to water because water is equal to about one gram per milliliter. Anything less dense than one floats. Anything more dense than one sinks. So I hope that's cleared up the difference between a fundamental and a derived unit. So go on and get this filled out and you'll get all those answers correct.